find it. What I need to do, I need a dot somewhere off the paper. So I'm making it right there. Good place for a dot. Some off my line of work again. Because then I just need to figure out how to measure this. Now, when we measure with these kinds of purposes, what we're trying to do is get one dot and that's circle, the point. And then we're trying to find another dot, another opening in our compass that matches. And so that looks like this one right here. We need to remember where that is. You can see that it does go through the point. That's just one mark past that. Then moving up to my upper space. Um, that is way too big. Yep. That went to this one, so I've done the wrong dot. See, I can't, can't seem to remember where that is. Okay, here it is. And if I've used the right one, which I think I did fine last time, these should be the same way. And what I'm doing is basically using the idea, so it's just a little past three and a half inches. I'm gonna use the millimeter side here to reinforce about eight and a half millimeters. And so when I check up here, I have four millimeters. So by using the same compass setting, we're ensuring that they are the same length. 